right, it's time for spring cleaning. And if you are thinking more than maybe just your house could use a little tidying up, financial experts say you might be right. Yeah, the house seems to be enough for us right now, but now is a great time to start. And most of the items that should be on your financial spring cleaning list can be completed in less than 30 minutes. Our financial expert, Andy Manningly, here now to talk about spring cleaning your financial situation. I like the 30 minutes part. <laughs> yes. Uh, what is one of the most likely areas that needs a little spring cleaning? Well, it's probably your budget. Whether you've been budgeting for a long time or you've just started, you probably need to change it or maybe, you know, things are changing in your life. So you need to take a look at that. All right, so give us all the advice here, Andy. Well, so the, the biggest thing here is to be honest with your budget. So a lot of times people will say, well, I'm going to budget $25 a week for eating out. Well, if you're really doing $100, then change your budget to that so you can make the other changes. So look at what you've been doing and make a realistic budget. So talk about loans and, and should we review our loan rates regularly. Yeah, you should do that because maybe your credit's improved or maybe rates have changed. And so look at your mortgage, your credit card, your auto loans and see if you can get a lower rate or maybe you can pay more so you can lower your rate on your mortgage because you can shorten the term. So you should always do that. How about investments? How can we clean those up? Two big things. One is rebalancing your portfolio to make sure you have the right diversification. And the other thing is to look at your risk, risk tolerance. Maybe you're a little bit older now and you want to take a little less risk. What about estate planning? Are there some things that should be a part of the spring cleaning effort? In that? Yeah, it's really important if you have changes in your family, married, divorce, adding children, you should look at your will, make sure you update that and look at all your beneficiaries on insurance and all your investments to make sure that that's accurate now. All right, so there's the 30 minute thing that piqued your interest. Is there anything that's really time consuming? Yeah, or maybe a little bit of work with your estate plan because you've got to kind of talk to an attorney and some of those things. But other than that, there's not really anything that has to be time consuming in this. Just trying to figure out how to Do get all. that basement <laughs> fixed right now. <laughs> Thanks, Andy.